Marshall White, a Selkirk Range Sasquatch, shot me a text and asked me if I wanted to go on a hike with him up into an area that he hasn't quite explored 100%. He said it was going to be an easy hike, just under two miles. He didn't tell me it was all uphill, though. A little bit of a climb for us with camera equipment in our packs. Ooh. <laughs> Just keep going up. So this is the gate. This isn't the gate that's locked, but this oh. is one of the gates. This is a quarry gate, I guess. I've hiked up here with another guy about quarter of the way. We get up a little ways, and there's a place where you go in the woods on the left, and it's like you're looking over a cliff over another part of a whole quarry. It's all dug out. So we, so we just heard, uh, this sound metal to you? Yeah. Like a metal bang of some sort. Sound like somebody had a bunch of junk in there. Now there's been more and more reports coming out of people hearing like a metallic type door slam sound. Um, I know Cliff from Finding Bigfoot has claimed to hear that as well. And I know some people around uh, Bailey Lake has also heard what sounded like a car door shut. I've also heard that out around Lake Ellen just once. On uh, one of my recorders, I heard what sounded like a car door, but no cars ever drove by the road or by the lake at all. So, interesting. There it is again. Over there. Maybe it's just a piece of metal blowing in the wind. Continuously. <laughs> yeah, so we just heard something right down this way. Okay, scenario. I know it's windy, so I'll speak up. <clears throat> So we heard something over there, right? Yeah. Let's just say something made a noise over there. Response noise over here. Let's say something said, hey, we're leaving this area. And then this guy over here is like, uh, they're over here now. Yeah.
so we're just walking out and the wind started picking up and I caught a big sniff of uh, something really, a really bad smell. And it was just for a second. I don't know.